Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I am soaking wet because I was it's just putting up the sprinklers. The sprinklers got me good. I have been like trying to water our, there's like a couple like patches in our grass that need to be watered. Um, anyway, I have Ciao, a hard time like Ciao. setting the sprinkler without getting totally sprayed. So anywho, um, welcome back to my channel. We are doing a camper clean. Oh my gosh, I'm getting like all the notifications right now. Um, I am doing a camper like clean with me get the camper ready with me stock the camper get groceries into the camper I want to show you guys what our camper like RV life looks like The door just swung open. We want to show you guys what it looks like to like live it RV style in the summer We will be camping like camping in our RV every single weekend this summer um out at the lake so i want to show you guys like what we do to prep um usually we're like going to campgrounds and things like that um this summer we're keeping it the camper at my grandparents lake cabin so we're bringing some things for more of like a permanent spot for the summer or a seasonal spot for the summer it's really windy outside and the door is like swinging like open and shut because i have just like the screen door open so anyway I want to show you guys like what it looks like because I've now learned from a lot of you like this is not a normal thing for you guys um, from like where like um, like where you guys are from this isn't a normal thing and I just grew up with it and I thought it was so normal to like have an RV like have a camper and there goes the door <laughs> um, I thought it was like super normal to have like an RV trailer um, like a travel trailer and like just bring it to the lake every weekend because like that's what we do the no. wind did that. So anyways, that's what we do every single weekend during the summer is we bring it to the lake um, and then we usually just like hang out at the beach, we go swimming, um, we go fishing, things like that um, at my ah. grandparents' cabin where my ca where my camper will be this summer, my travel trailer, whatever you want to call it. Um, there are, we've got like docks in the water and there's um, like a boat and some kayaks and we've got like a slide and like a lily pad, like a like water lily pad thing that we can play on. So there's lots of fun things that we are able to do like in the water and we just like to chill by the water, have some food, some snacks. So I'm gonna show you guys like what I typically do to load up the camper um, for the summer. Posting pictures on the gram so other people know that we're more than friends. And ever since you came around, I've never been sober, always in my head. Met you at a time when I was so low.
morning, you guys. It is Memorial Day. It's Monday and I am this Memorial Day and we just got back from visiting Mike's grandma's grave, which is actually just on the, the um, road from um, where we're at the lake for at the summer. My grandparents cabin. Um, anyway, so we just went there for Memorial Day and I wanted to run through the camper with you guys really quick um, while I'm putting Riker down for a nap. Um, trying to get this computer to charge. Okay. So, um, the fan is on right now, so it's kind of loud. Um, but earlier in this video, you guys saw me, like, cleaning up the camper and, like, getting things ready. Um, so I just wanted to quickly give you, like, a once over in the camper and like show you guys like how we set everything up what it looks like like lived in and things like that um okay so behind me is the air conditioner that's why it's so loud in here right now um i look like a hot mess because i haven't put makeup on in like several days I haven't showered this is lake life all right so i am standing at the door right now when you first walk into the camper we usually have a rug right here um but it got lost, I don't know where it went. And then I have a rug over here. This is the table, usually, but this is where we're going to be having Riker sleeping for the summer. Um, and then this is a couch that pulls out into a bed. And then this over here, so we have three beds that bump out, and that's this one, and they're all like full-size beds. So we've got this one, we've got this one, and we've got this one in the back hiding behind that curtain. Um, so what I've done for setup for the summer, so again, I've got Riker's crib here set up for the summer. This is where we keep our bags. Um, it's like e on either side of him. Um, right now I'm trying to get a movie going for him because he's getting ready to go down for a nap. Um, I do bring like bags of clothes to swap stuff out, um, but up here, so like above Mike and I's bed, so here's our bed, it's not made, <laughs> but up here above we've got a radio, um, and then this is actually a, this is actually a spot for like a phone, um, but this right here, I've got bins up here full of clothes for the kids, so like here's Kaya's side, it's got Kaya's Kaya's clothes are up here. I've got the baby monitor. I've got sh um, another bin behind this one that has um, shoes. And then I've got some larger items like sweatshirts, like bulky sweatshirts. And then this side is mostly rakers. I've got some um, mud boots or rain boots for Kaya if it gets rainy. Um, a couple of hats. I've got a beach bag. Oh, got a couple hats. There's a beach bag in this corner over here. Um, this is Riker's diaper and wipes, some diaper, some suit. Um, I do need to get one more bin for Riker's clothes. Um, and then, and then over here in this dark corner, which is not like being picked up very nicely by the camera right now, is where I keep all of my hats. Like we have a, there we go, we have a hook right here um, that I keep all of our hats because we wear a lot of hats in the summertime at the lake. Um, so yeah, so that's what we keep in this area. Um, and again, like here's my clothes and then Mike's clothes are in this backpack and the kids' this extra clothes are in here. Up here is usually just like a catch-all for stuff. I'm trying to keep this more organized. Um, this dish rack is gonna go underneath the camper so that this isn't taking up so much room. This is meant for a TV, but um, yeah, anyways, just, it's, we don't use a TV here. We always use our laptop and we've got a projector. Um, so we don't use this for a TV. But um, I do want to, like, come up with a better organizational system for up here because it just looks like a mess right now. Um, this is our pantry cupboard, which I showed you guys in the clips earlier. Um, and it has, like, a three-drawer thing here. And I have, like, all individually baked snacks. Um, so that if we're not out here for a couple weeks, the snacks will stay good. Um, I need to clean up from this weekend and figure out what we're going to take back with us and what's going to stay here, etc. Um, crackers, like, but all of the good yummy things are in here. Um, and then here's our fridge. So again, like, bed, 
crib, couch, and then we've got our fridge freezer combo. Um, I've got barely anything in here right now, just snacks. So like our camper is the snack station um, from like where it's sitting at. And then the rest of like the meal stuff is upstairs in the cabin because we're at my um, grandparents' cabin. So we just keep snacks and like easy meals, things like that. Um, I've got some Otter Pops in the freezer, some Icy's for the kids, um, and then some more popsicles. So like I said, burgers and chicken are upstairs in the actual cabin fridge. Um, and then I just have like milk and water bottles and like things to drink in here for the kids and for the adults. Um, underneath the fridge is where I keep all of our water bottles. Um, we do not have running water out here right now, so we use a lot of water bottles um, for even like cleaning and like brushing our teeth and stuff. Over here on this side, so again, like here's the couch, turn around, like there's the door, and here's a little like kitchen, kitchenette, whatever you want to call it. Um, but I've got our Keurig here, so we can have coffee in the morning as soon as we get up, um, hand sanitizer and hand wash. Um, and then this is another catch-all place. We need a lot of catch-all places um, just because people have like sunglasses and like these are my vitamins. Um, we've got like crayons and charging cords and keys. Um, and then up here, up here above the coffee maker, we do keep our charging cord. This charging cord is really nice because it has three um, cables on it. So you can charge three um, like iPhones or iPad or Apple devices at one time super nice Again, we do not have running water, but I did just clean out Riker's bottle in here and it looks like somebody has cereal this morning real life Look at these water bottles. Okay, okay so we do not use this bathroom again because we do not have like we don't have like sewer and like water hooked up, but over here on the shower head I do keep like I do keep all of our washcloths, our loofah, towels, beach towels, etc. Kaya's, um, what's it called? Kaya's robe is hanging up in here. And then I have like toothbrushes, toothpaste, shampoo, conditioner. I just get like cheap shampoo and conditioner for out here. Um, I've got all of my first aid stuff on this shelf. Um, I'm sorry, it's such a mess in here right now. We've like been living in this for the past few days. Um, this is our water bottle for brushing our teeth. Um, and then down here, we have my, this is like my brush and my makeup. And then all of our like mosquito spray, our sun care, um, like skin care stuff. So we got sunblock, aloe vera, after sun lotion. All of that fun stuff. The reason why we liked this camper is because it has this little like jut out. So here's the bathroom and then it has this little jut out and a lot of campers don't have this um, or like the pop out, the combo style um, travel trailers don't have this, which was super nice. It gave us all of this storage underneath. Um, this is a smoker. Okay, again, real mom life. This is so messy, oh my gosh. Um, Okay, so we keep our projector underneath here. It's actually sitting on top of the smoker right now because the girls projected it like up on their thing last night. But um, we keep the projector here. We've got a bunch of the kids' toys. We've got adult games and then we've got sheets. Down here we keep the dog food. Um, we've got a, an extra fishing tackle bag. Um, our shoe basket. I try to keep all of our shoes together over here. So this is usually empty um, I've got two like floaties for the lake here, which need to go under the camper This is the smoker it needs to go upstairs in the garage um, So this is again bed number two and then This is bed number three and this is usually like if we're having guests stay with us in our camper We'll put them in this one because it's a little bit more private um but yeah, it goes all the way back. Super, super nice. Um, good spacing. And then also has like a little nook for like charging your phones and things like that over there. Um, when this giant smoker is not in the way, as you guys can see, we've got like a little hanger thing here on the wall. And this is where we like will hang any like towels, 
um, bags, backpacks, etc. Another really nice charging station because the plug-in's down here, and then you can set your phone inside here. Um, the girls' water bottles, Kaya and um, Bryn have been sleeping in this bed um, together, so I've got like Bryn's glasses and some water bottles and things like that. But um, you guys, you guys can see I've got some cleaning up to do. We do plan on renovating it, so like this god awful like print in these colors. I mean, this is a newer camper, but the prints are just terrible. So we're just gonna make it our own. We're gonna paint everything. Um, yeah, and just make it super cutesy. You guys know us and our renovations. We always are looking for something to redo. So camper renovations are super fun. And um, I think that this one would be so cute, like with the floors, like with a, like a driftwoody wood, like white walls. Um, and then like dark doors and I want to paint the fridge black and all of the things <sighs> Okay, you guys that is going to be the like first video. Actually, I'm gonna set up this movie I'm gonna set up a movie for Riker and then I'm gonna go sit outside by the lake and then I'll talk to you guys All right, you guys the lighting is really bad, but that is going to wrap up this little like welcome to my camper video and welcome to all of the camping videos we've got lots of stuff coming up for you guys I'm gonna do like I'm gonna do like a um, a compilation video of like how we um, like showing us setting up the camper and then showing us taking down the camper and like what we do every single weekend to get ready and all of the things and like some of my tips and tricks of like camping with kids because a lot of you guys have asked me about that as well so all the things coming for you guys all right i hope you had an amazing weekend with your family i hope it was relaxing hope you guys found some fun things to do and i will see you guys in a couple days for another really fun video okay bye guys